Howdy folks, Luis Slade in here, and this is your Farm to Market Report. Sorghum harvest is in full swing in the Rio Grande Valley. This row crop is naturally drought tolerant, which makes it an ideal crop for local growers. It's used mainly for livestock feed. However, in recent years, it has gained popularity among those that lead a gluten-free diet. Before sorghum is ready for the farm to market, it must be harvested. As the combine harvester makes its go around the field, the trucks eagerly await to be loaded with the harvested seeds. As the combine approaches, one can hear the sheer power of this modern agricultural piece of equipment. Sorghum stocks is gathered in by the header at the front. The reel pushes the crops down towards the cutter. Its teeth cut off the crop at their base and fed by spinning augers to a drum that shake the grain away. The unwanted material is disposed of at the back of the machine. Once the harvester's grain tank is full, a tractor that follows it closely, pulling a grain bin, will help empty out the seeds. It's never too young to learn the trade. Here's a young boy riding shotgun as he enjoys his summer vacation. Once the grain tank is full, the tractor will be driven next to an 18 wheeler waiting to be loaded. The grain is carried up from the tank by an elevator and shoots out of the side pipe into the trailer. The tractor operator is responsible for the movement of the grain bin from one end of the trailer to the next. He watches carefully to make sure the grain does not spill. It's individuals like this that help make farm to market possible. Reporting to you from Westlake, Texas with your Farm to Market Report, Luis Slate.